Defense attorneys for Brandon McCall are trying to portray him as a victim during the punishment phase of his capital murder trial for killing a Richardson police officer back in 2018. CBS 11's J.D. Miles is live at the Collin County Courthouse for us today where the defendant's friends, a brother as well, all took the witness stand today. J.D., take us inside. Doug, defense attorneys brought Brandon McCall's brother over from jail to tell the jury about their family's dark and disturbing past of homelessness and neglect to try and get the jury to spare Brandon McCall's life. Michael McCall is a habitual offender who told the jury he started shoplifting to feed his family at age six. The 32-year-old appeared in shackles and a jail uniform to testify in the sentencing phase of his younger brother's capital murder trial. McCall says he hated life when he recalled growing up living in a car with his brother and their parents because their father was an alcoholic. The defendant's brother says it led to drug abuse and unemployment by both brothers, as well as run-ins with police. If you knew we were going to live like this, why the heck would you have us? We might as well be dead, McCall referring to his deceased parents. No, it wasn't easy because we saw a side of him that nobody else saw. Karen Revels knows Brandon McCall and provided character witness testimony, along with his childhood friends and former employers. She says he was a good person until he briefly lived with his drug addicted brother. I never felt threatened in any way at all. And I don't know what happened when he went to Oxahatchee with his brother. You know, something changed him. But Revels and others could not explain and would not excuse McCall's decision to kill his roommate inside their Richardson apartment, then open fire on responding officers, killing David Sherrard. One of them told the jury, quote, I feel what he did. I'm very disappointed, but I can't let him go. The jury will have to decide how this testimony stacks up with the state's case that McCall callously let his roommate bleed to death after shooting him and then that ambush on those Richardson police officers gunning down one of their best. Live in McKinney, J.D. Miles, CBS 11 News. J.D., thank you.